What's up, y'all? I got a family for you, so let's get into this tea. What really happened? Sit down, talk part two. Let's get into it. Yo, two. What's good? It's your boy MOD. Uh, this is part two of the of the uh, great sit down conversation we be having. We've been having. Um, y'all already know who's back there. And yeah, let me go see. Let's see back in here. Second half. Second half of the show. Um, you pulled up already? Yeah, I poured it up. Oh, right, cause I, no, I just hit the bottle so you don't get yellow. No. Oh, yeah, yeah, I'm bougie. Um, so, all right, let's ask preliminary questions. So, what did you think? So, why, like, when we wasn't speaking, what did you think we wasn't speaking for? What did I think or what was I told? Like in Either a, one, but what, like, because I, I know, bro, both our, both our developments of our stories grow from just rumors yeah a lot of and a lot of outside people, noise yeah then. outside noise but like what did you initially think why we had stopped speaking um initially i thought like to myself without speaking to nobody i thought it had something to do with one the podcast mm -hmm. two um somehow like the group chat somehow okay. Kinda, okay. yeah yeah but then niggas was telling me that you was just trying to like work on yourself trying to just but who was telling you that lee mm, probably, like my sister good. i think um who else told me that <laughs> should have been that deep right who would have known niggas was lee niggas who i feel like there's somebody else that told her i don't want to say the wrong person just put them in there <laughs> catch a straight. Yeah, yeah, that'd catch a straight. Gotta do it. But there is somebody else that told like you were just trying to just work on yourself so you could just be a better friend or a better better you. You know what I mean? Like mm -hmm. that's 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 what I was I was told. Bro, cause I feel like for the longest time, like before all the outside noise really came into it, I really didn't think we had a problem. I just thought it wasn't speaking. Mm -hmm. And I just thought that was normal. Mm -hmm. Like I didn't think, cause I didn't in the beginning when the, when we when we had stopped speaking. Like I never thought, yo, I'm never gonna talk to Clarence again. It's more like, okay, I'm just not dealing with this shit mm -hmm. right here. We're gonna have to figure out whatever this shit is. But like I'm like not. Of course I'm gonna talk to Clarence again. Like mm -hmm. it's not no fucking world ending yeah. thing. Like you ain't do nothing to me. The fucking put nah, it to that ain't do nothing to me either. That's why yeah. it was so confusing. But. I feel like the longer it went on, it kind of became like, yeah, it just, it's, you started to believe shit. Yeah, believe so shit, and it became like the norm, though, like, mm -hmm. yeah, I mean, it just came, we, I, yeah, I had to live, a, I had to learn to live a new life. <laughs> I, I went from talking to you every day to like, yo, all of a sudden, I could talk to this joint for mad hours on the phone. All of a sudden, niggas that don't usually get to stay on the phone with me for this many hours is on the phone with me for this many hours. So, definitely, um, definitely was that adjustment period. Oh, um, what's the wildest thing <laughs> you heard somebody say that I was doing, like, or said about you, or like I was doing? <laughs> I I'm not gonna say who it was, but I heard you made a diss track about me. <laughs> oh no! I'm not gonna lie, I heard that through the great vibe game. This nigga made a. I heard this nigga made a diss track. When niggas say diss track, I'm thinking no suburban chef G. <laughs> oh my god, this thing is crazy. Like, are we gonna have to fight? <laughs> like, yo, the diss was crazy. Yo, the diss, the diss, diss. Yo, bro. That's the bro. I'm not gonna lie. The craziest thing this I heard. Is crazy. The what? craziest thing I heard was that she was gonna wash me when you see Word. me. Word. Yeah. Who's talking about? Nah, nah, nah. I can't nah, say. Nah. I can't say. Who? Bro, look. I had no plans on fighting. <laughs> I really didn't. I'm not bro, about that's what I heard. I'm like, I'm like, bro. We all what? trying to figure what? out who and shit. Niggas is like, niggas is like, yo, Clarence say he can't <laughs> talk to you. Because if he talked to you, you're going to say something disrespectful. He's going to end up watching you. I'm like, first of all, I'm going to the gym now. <laughs> <laughs> first of all, I've been in the gym three months. That nigga is like 189. That nigga like 190 right now. Like, first of all, I'm going to 
to the gym now. Like, what are you doing? Yeah, like, yeah, this is I had no, I had really no plan. I had no plans. Mm. I was just, I, I did at a point didn't think I could talk to you because it's like, I was just hurt, probably in my feelings more or anything because I just felt like I was kind of like left in the dark a little bit. Like, mm. it was no, bro, I had no problem. Like, you stop speaking to me. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. just tell me. Like, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. yo, yo, you know, like, bro, it's been a while, you know, I'm like, I'm, I'm tired of this, so I, I don't want to do this. Like, you know, I think it's just, like, that's just the, to me, that's just, like, the right thing to do. Nah, yeah, You know yeah, what yeah, I mean? Yeah. Like, yeah, yeah. I'm not going to lie, I realized, I realized from my situation that I always said I wanted to be better than my parents, specifically my father, and, um, I really acted like him in our situation. Your father cuts niggas off. Oh. <laughs> niggas are all. Oh. <laughs> nigga got no friends right now. More yeah, yeah, yeah. money. That nigga can tell you, well, right now, every reason why he don't talk to all yeah. the, the niggas that, all his niggas, like, you go to That shit like, can't be happy, though. Like, it, like, he, like, he could be happy, but it's like, it's not the best. And yeah. I... That shit can be happy. I'm not gonna lie. I have absolutely... Cut niggas off and nigga, I am fine. I'm actually better than what I was when I was with niggas. But what I did learn is everybody is not for everybody. Like real shit. That's 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 one of the best lessons I've ever learned. I will say that. Everybody, we all just not for each other. You know what I'm saying? One group is better for the other group, and the other group is better for the other group. But who was for me is for me, okay? The people that's in my life now, we just mesh. And that whole internet, trying to make internet friends bullshit, nah. That's why this was worth it for them. Because they this shit was before the internet. Fuck this internet shit. This was before the internet. This was worth it. Yeah, even yeah, even our best. situation has showed me more about, like, niggas that I love, too. You know what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah. Like, taking it for granted. Like, my nigga Ant. Like, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Shout out to my nigga Ant. Right. You feel me? Like, I, I haven't talked to my nigga. We so close. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But I'm so... It, it wasn't It wasn't just my... to be an asshole or nothing. I'm just so traumatized, gang. Like, mm -hmm. PTSD. You know yeah. shit that I've been through. It's like... Word. You know, niggas come around you and just start doing whatever. Doing whatever, like, yo, you know what I'm saying? So, wow, shit. And I got, I got a five foot PTSD. I don't think niggas be giving me enough grace for the fact that I was small my whole life. So like, when I feel away, like I just naturally, like I just, it just be up for me, like it just be up because I was. Funny. Yeah, you still got a small nigga complex. Yeah, like, I was like six. Bro, I was short till I was eighteen. I'm wow. only thirty. I don't even, I don't even full grown for twelve years. I was short more of my life, so like when my Napoleon complex kicks in that I'm not supposed to have no more because I'm not a Napoleon, it just be like, yeah, it's over. Once I feel like I got treated a certain way, like I wouldn't treat somebody else, it just be like over, be totally over. But shit, um, I know a lot is liquor kicking in because I had a question too and I forgot. <laughs> but it, it'll come back to me though. If I, you know what I was gonna say? Um, um, we got a uh, how we got into a, uh, our, our conversation though on July Fourth. What you mean? Like we wasn't taught. We we had played it copacetic. Like we was cool. We was laughing. We was joking about the times and mm -hmm. shit that we passed. And then our men. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, niggas. That's what I said. The people around us was probably was more curious about yeah. did y'all niggas solve it or not yeah. than just the cookout. Yeah. Like I get, I think we was kind of kind of got lost in them. Yeah, I fucking uh, on July fourth, our men's. Uh, I think I was Izzy. Juice and Izzy was here as well. And like we outside, we cool and like me and this nigga Clarence. I'm not gonna lie, we. We done drank, we off the tea now. <laughs> like, we feeling good, like, we good. We cool, and it's like, like nothing. Yeah, it's like, nothing. Yeah, it's, time, like we, it's like we took a year off, but we still chilling. And then nigga, nigga, <laughs> nigga, is he like, yo, I'm not gonna lie. It's like dope. It's like, everybody had one inside, Juice had one inside, Pops went inside, and nigga, is he like, yo, it's just dope to see, like, 
yeah, two, yeah, yeah. two black men come together and like y'all here cooling and talking and nigga nigga Clarence is like no he didn't he still said more he's like y'all cooling y'all talking but I'm not gonna lie Clarence at certain times Ma was like fuck Clarence <laughs> Ma was like fuck Clarence and it's like I can't say I completely disagree with him from his perspective yeah. and then niggas is that's like, how I started <laughs> and I, I wanted to know what nigga niggas, niggas is that's like, what? like fuck Clarence niggas like Yo, gang. I ain't gonna lie, that's wild. That would've pissed me off. We ain't even talk yet. <laughs> yeah, I'm not like, we, we, we ain't even talk yet. And then that's really what started our whole... We ain't getting nowhere the first day. Nah. Until the end when we agreed nah, on certain yeah. things. <laughs> yeah, I still, I, I, I still felt some type of way a little bit the first day. Yeah, bro. When yeah, I, when yeah, I, like, I, I ain't felt like... Like, I felt like we ain't really understand each other. Nah. You know what I'm saying? But kind of took a few more times. No, not really a few more times. Bro, the next time I see you was basketball. Yeah, we really ain't we we spoke that day. We was cool. Yeah, we, we was texting text every now and every now and again. I think I had called you on some random shit about Bronny or some shit. Cause I'm like, yo, we're gonna be friends. Like niggas gotta make attempts. Like, so I just called you like, yo, bro, you see my Bronny head. doing some shit and we talking about basketball, but again, we just talked about basketball, so like we could talk about that all day without even being friends or not friends. And then um yeah, it wasn't really till we played ball, Mo. And that really turned into like a eighteen hour conversation it felt like. Like we was talking from like three in the afternoon yeah. to like eight in the morning. Just to make sure it's clear, because they're gonna they gonna they gonna clip this too. What? So you didn't make a diss track. <laughs> nah, nah, you never nah, denied it though. That's why I was like, nah, I never. They was gonna take that. They was gonna nah, take nah, that. You gotta nah, be careful. Nah, I'm telling you. Nah, I never officially made a diss track, but I was recorded at a studio. But your feelings on the track, maybe? Yeah, my feelings. That's on the track. different than a different. Nah, my diss I've I've spoken for longer hours. I'm not even gonna get. Up. So three to eight is good. Track, I never like, said I never had a track where your name but like I never said Clarence right, and this. Bro, in the this world. track is crazy. This yeah. track is just I think I know exactly what song he's talking about too. But I can't like it wasn't a song I was ever gonna put out and I can't remember the whole song. But I think I we know should react to it one day. The song? Yeah, yeah I like, think if I could find the song, it's probably in my email. Definitely, I could definitely find react the song. React to that one one day. I actually got a song. I actually got a song where uh yeah. I actually got a song. Did y'all see Clarence Wheels turning on that? But I can't like it wasn't a song I was ever Here's the start of the Wheels. We're gonna put out and I can't remember the whole song. Wheels. But I think I We should react to it one day. The song? Yeah, yeah I think like, if I could find the That is his initiative as a friend to let it be known. Bro, I'm going to help you however I can help you. If we got to do it, we got to react to it. If I got to support your music, nigga. Even if you talking about me, I'm cool with it. I like it. That's good. The That's bro. probably in my email. Definitely. I could definitely That's find fucking that bro. One, one day. I actually got a song. I actually got a song where... Uh, I actually got a song. I think I'm still going to put it out, though. It's not a distraction. <laughs> bro, as long as... <laughs> As long as you're not nah, on your nah, bro, your it's like a song where it's like it's like a song where it's like it's like I don't remember what the line before is, but it's like it's like if they ask me the truth, I'm gonna lie about it, say yes every time. I'm gonna guard about it or some shit like that. But like I'm talking about us, like I'm not gonna go yeah. out and be fucking like bad mouthing you. Like that's that's what the the point of that track is. But that's not the, that's not the one I don't think he can yeah. say this track though. But you know, oh, you that's what I was gonna say. The, before the lick it started hitting me, right? Yeah. <laughs> Old Tay. <laughs> It's yeah, a great time to talk about yeah, this is yeah. definitely yeah. a good I time. I'm saving this for part two. Okay, yeah. I feel like that's more you. Yeah, you know yeah, what I yeah, mean. Yeah. So, okay, <laughs> like I want to like, let's bro, like, where do you, bro? I'm not gonna lie, you have way more questions like from your reaction of shit than mine than me. I was like, yo, no, bro, but do you did you understand that like I was confused a little bit because you was like you like kind of I forgot what the word you used, but you kind of like. Went against who you were to compromise. do the song. You compromised. Yeah. I, yeah. But you compromised too. Yo, I OD felt like I compromised, bro. That's where, like, you know what I'm saying? I didn't, 
I didn't have no problem with what you said. I thought the video you did was mad funny. I don't yeah. know if you see my reaction. No, I, I did see it. Yeah, shit. you was dead. I'm like, this thing is funny. Yeah, like, yeah, even yeah. though I'm not fucking with this thing, yeah. this thing is funny. You know? <laughs> yeah. Word. Because the nigga, bro, and you chose to do the fucking butt, open button up. What I didn't realize bro. is why did we both go sh no shirt under the bro, second scene? Bro, bro, first of all, that was you. Bro, all right, blame me for that. Blame me for that. <laughs> what I'm saying is, it wasn't, I didn't have, you didn't give me any guidance on the outfit. But the I guidance, could. you could have gave me guidance, but bro, bro, Lee is telling me. <laughs> So Lee Stiles, you what you said. Bro, Lee Are y'all are closed mouths don't get fed type of friends? You know what I realized in all of my relation, friendships that failed, right? Is when I open my mouth, I done, I've done too much. Like, y'all, I'm not going to lie, bro. That outfit ain't it. Because you could tell me the same shit. Let me know if my outfit ain't it. Oh, shit, I'm fucked up. Okay, let me, let me get my shit together. So I'm the type to be like, yo, bro, your outfit ain't it. I'm trying to date. Yeah, nigga. I just felt some type of way that you told me my outfit wasn't it. Like. <laughs> okay, so maybe I won't say nothing. All right. Let me not say shit. Like, damn, nigga, why you ain't tell me? Girl. Telling me, bro, I wanted to wear Give a normal a fit I would normally wear. Lee is like, bro, you got to change your image. You got to do something different. Yeah, bro, like, get the button down. Bro, first of all, bro, I was supposed to take that shirt back to Nordstrom. That shit's like a $300 shirt. You should have took that back with the Versace suits. <laughs> I never let you. No, you never jacked those. Yeah, you never, never jacked those. You never jacked those. You, jack those. you could have went Balenci, save 300 No, nah, I could have saved <laughs> Cause yeah. I already had the blue with George, yeah. I didn't want to just get the black George, but I should have just got the black the black shit. I should have, yeah, I, I should have just got the black. Blue <laughs> okay. Blue. I hate those shoes. Wait, I'm gonna keep it a hundred at all times. I expect the same from my friends, right? And see, like I said, the people that's in my life now, and I say that for a reason because everything is definitely fresh. Uh, I'm gonna just keep it at that. So, with that being said, niggas don't. They had an issue with friends because they was too sensitive as well. Nobody was looking for friends, like, at all. We was like, nigga, I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> Shout out to my brother Danny. Rest in peace, Danny, bro. This nigga right here got niggas with new friends. Because I'm telling you right now, we was not with it. They wasn't with it. We wasn't with it. We like, oh, what's going on? Before he passed, nigga, he introduced the niggas. And we like, okay, what's going on? Hell yeah. Anyway, uh, you know. And then we just end up getting close as shit. And, um, yeah, like, all that sensitivity and fucking, nigga, I don't, I don't, I don't feel like juggling to see, should I say something? Should I not say something? Like, it, I, I noticed that I cannot have friends like that. If I feel like I have to walk on one shell, okay? If I can't just openly say how I feel without you thinking I'm fucking disrespecting you, I can't do it. Yeah, I can't do it at all. I need to be able to speak to you. You know what I'm saying? So you should be able to speak to me. Period. Like that's the that's the worst purchase I ever made in life. Like those two should like a band. Yeah, those are the worst purchase I've ever made. In I don't life. know what Versace yeah. thought they was doing. Copying. Long live Danny, by the way. But y'all go charge your niggas more though. It's crazy. Yeah, it was crazy. But yeah, but, but yeah, yeah Otay made that bad decision with Otay though with the shirt though, because like. I was just trying to listen. Like, I don't usually listen. I'm not good at You're listening. Not a listener. Yeah. But I took that that time, like, yo, I'm a listener. That okay. too. Yeah. If you ain't a listening friend. That was different. different. Do it bad. Fit. And it wasn't until I reacted to your shit, I realized I ain't have a shirt under my Gucci jacket, which is <laughs> even crazy, I think. <laughs> Like that's not even that kind of you know you sexy shit I did. Nah. <laughs> that didn't sexy. age well, gang. Like you were saying my shit was age well, that didn't age Bro, well. Bro, your fits age better than mine's. Why though? Cause it's Gucci? I have no shirt under my shit, bro. We're in a fucking factory. We're in a warehouse, gang. And I have no shirt on. Bro, I think like we I ain't like that. I ain't like that. Like, I'm not gonna lie, the video is so like I'm just I I just ain't know you felt like that at first, like you know what I'm saying, like. Bro, but I, I do you, remember. Bro, I thought you always thought I felt like I thought you always knew I didn't like Otato. No, bro. There's a difference between you not, like <laughs> you never say you ain't like it. 
You, I think you remember. I remember expre- you expressing yourself as. Bro, like, I remember it being could in the be room better. like, yo, this, this. No, be- your thing was like, it could be better. Mm-hmm. I don't know if that's your nice way of saying it was trash. Yeah. But your shit was like, it could be better. Yeah. Me, I was saying. I feel uncomfortable. <laughs> like I feel uncomfortable mm-hmm. doing this. You wasn't really thinking about the sound. Yeah, it wasn't about everything. I just felt uncomfortable doing all of this. You know what I'm saying? Like. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie. That was a time where I probably should have. I remember the perfect time you could have t- t- when we was in my house and my but I think it was the day before or something. We was in the room. We listened to it and we both started laughing like, nah, it's <laughs> not. <laughs> <laughs> Cause the Roddy Rich had just came off, like literally. We was like, we was like, nah, it's not hitting. Like, it's- <laughs> that's fucking terrible. I remember us being in the room, like, nah, we're playing this shit out loud. We're yeah. like, yo, go get the speaker. Yeah, like, we're trying to make it. Like, it's not like, really nah, hitting. No, no, it wasn't really hitting. But bro, you know, people really like. I, I realized, love song, bro, like, I realized from that, like, yo, I have to chill with my opinion, cause like my opinion is like yeah, terrible. So many people, bro. Perception of the song, bro. That shit is still one of my top stream songs. Nah, to this day. <laughs> but people really do love this shit. If you go on TikTok right now and put Clarence NYC Mod or Old Tate, bro, there's mad TikTok saying like, yo, these niggas had the whole world saying Old Tate, which we had, we did though. <laughs> That's we old. had the work. Yeah, it just wasn't the right song, that's old. That's old. but the song was OD Force. It was OD Force and Rushed. I wouldn't say Force. It was Rushed. Definitely Rushed. It was Rushed. Definitely we made rushed. that shit. You would have thought we was on Little Baby. But yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah it was Rushed. We made that shit in like it was two super recording rushed. sessions. It was super Rushed, but I didn't even have the chance, bro. I'm not gonna lie. I really thought that was my opportunity, like, cause you remember I had did the whole tape right there. I had a whole, I got a whole album on my phone of beats from that same producer mm-hmm. right now. Where I really thought like, yo, Ote's gonna be the thing that gets me inside the label. They're gonna take this serious, and then I'm gonna be able to run around this house once I figure it out. Yeah. But it just, I don't even know what happened with that. I don't even know what happened. With that. <laughs> I, yeah, I know it. niggas wanted me to be a rapper so bad, but I just didn't want to do it. Yeah, like, at that time. And I, I, at the point, I knew like it could have worked. You know what I'm saying? Like I know it could have worked, but just because something could work, don't mean that's what you should do. Right. You know what I mean? You probably would put out one project if it didn't go platinum. You was gonna be done anyway. Yeah, fucking project. You had I one project. Probably kept going singles. If my like, bro, I'm just not. I'm not, bro. I'm not. Bro. Yeah, for that. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> like, and that's I'm where like, niggas lose because yeah, like, yeah. you don't love it, bro. Yeah, I'm not for the bag. Not catch me in the studio. <laughs> Like, fuck it, I'm only going to the studio because I haven't dropped in eight months. Yeah. <laughs> like, you really think the old Tate thumbnail is crazy? No, yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. No, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. OD. I'm not going to lie, OD. OD, it was just. <laughs> bro, my son had the professional thumbnail. Like, you had the. Bro, I spent $10 on that because I no. knew that was going. <laughs> <laughs> no, bro. What did I say though? I told you I knew what it was. I knew what it was going. Yeah, I knew what it was. I knew it was going. I knew it was going. I'm like, oh, Tay, bro, cause bro, really? But it was genuine how it really happened though. I didn't, I didn't just wake up and tell the old Tay story, bro. I'm on TikTok Live and they talk about old Tay. I'm like, yo, I fucking hate that song. And they're like, you hate that song? I'm like, yeah, I hate that song. I never made a dollar off that shit. That shit was the stupidest thing I ever did. Like, looking back on it, I don't know why I did it. Then, bro. The- why did not make a dollar would still be my issue today? Do you think Clarence feels a little bit bad that Mod is not up like him? Y'all, my... Uh, <laughs> yes. I think he does feel bad. But I think... I think that my, like my knows he don't listen. My could still be up tomorrow. You get what I'm saying? If my, if they decided today, I right, bet we're going to start making content together. Kai and Phantom this shit. You really have to have a level Kai and Phantom head. However, Kai and Phantom didn't necessarily come up together per se. So I think when they met each other, they was on the rise. You know what I'm saying? And then Kai surpassed everybody. So you have to really have a certain amount of confidence to understand that. And I really think that Mod, he don't get that or that's just not in his nature. And 
I don't think that that's a disrespectful thing. I don't think that he would like he I don't think that he would like this comment though that I'm saying, but I feel that way. Like I feel like he wants to be just where everybody is, but not realizing it may take a little more work. You know what I'm saying? Like I just my my opinion is just so different because I feel like Ma could be up tomorrow, man. And if he just listen and kind of play that role that he's supposed to play, hold your head. You know what I'm saying? If he just hold his head a little bit and understand that's just your route. That may not be Clarence's route. And hold your head, gang. That's all you got to do. Hold your head, play, play your role, get your bread. You up. Simple as that. You got the whole dream team. This nigga got the Avengers around him. This nigga got the Ninja Turtles around him. You know what I'm saying? Power Rangers. He got a whole lot of groups of men that are winning. I just, he he will have to change his mindset in order to make that work. But I do feel like Clarence does feel bad. Yes. The, the YouTube algorithm start doing the funny shit. So I had that conversation on TikTok. I'm like, nah, I don't know if I could tell this story. Like, I'm literally on TikTok like, I don't know. Maybe, maybe this could be a story time. Like, I want to do stories behind the music and shit, but maybe, I don't know. This probably be a little tricky right now, right? Then I'm fucking sitting there, and I'm on the phone with Ty. Yo, Ty be in the middle of a lot of shit. I'm on the phone with Ty. Ty like, yo, bro, I never realized that Clarence and Legend was the thumbnail to the OT video. <laughs> How'd y'all pick that? Guy, you know, that's crazy. <laughs> he said, how'd y'all pick that? I'm like, yo, bro, I, honestly, I just think at that time, Legend was just born. So I think it just like worked as like the smartest decision for like getting clicks on the video. I tried to lose that myself. <laughs> that's basically what you Because, bro, there were so many things that I peeped that I didn't peep until your reaction, bro. I didn't know the whole song is about me. <laughs> <laughs> bro, that's one of the funniest shits. Like, the chorus don't got nothing to do with shit. Not a damn thing. Like, not, not a damn thing. Bro, like, the song saying, structure in take, itself was already off. Like, how are we taking this back to the marketing room yo, and say that this is it? Yeah, but it's like, yo, that was that was dumb funny to I me, used to bro. Be that was now mad. Okay, look at my wrist, pull up like OT. <laughs> look at my chin, pull up like OT. <laughs> my, my whip, whip pull up like OT. Nigga <laughs> just had to do it. my son, my son. <laughs> I'm a legend. My son is like, like nothing is about you, gang. Like, like good. that whole chorus. The chorus was just about me. Like, yeah, your good. verse was about you. Yeah. Like, it was just. I had to squeeze myself. Yeah, in. Yeah, that was mad fun. But I swear to God, bro. Like, I. I don't think that you know how he just said that. Y'all, I could. And see, I don't be wanting to pick this shit apart because I, I think people think that I be trying to like start shit, and I do not. I, I I think my the guy could be a, a dope ass nigga. First of all, let's just put it like this: he is a dope ass nigga. But I think his potential would be so much greater if he would just um, believe in himself. Like Clarence feel as though his outfit did not age well, right? And then Ma still said, "I feel like yours didn't age well. I feel like mine was worse than yours, basically, right?" Clarence, like, nigga, why? Because my shit was Gucci? Like, what's your, what's the reason? You know what I'm saying? Why couldn't it be our shit didn't age well? You know what I'm saying? Why does Clarence, why does Mod's outfit have to be worse than Clarence's outfit? You know what I'm saying? And I think that's the confidence level. I don't feel like he is not confident in himself in general. But I think when it comes to him being around niggas, shit get a little different. But I ain't sitting around with Kai and, and Clarence and Phantom. I'm not. But I have sat around a lot of niggas with a lot of money. Hell, I've sat around these niggas before. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I never felt that way. Ever. Niggas came up to, what's going on, Clarence? How you doing? You good? Yeah, yeah, Ma, what's going on? You know what I'm saying? That's me, though. Nigga, I was, nigga, I had a couple dollars in my pocket. I had on the same outfit I wore for Three days in a row because I didn't get with them till Sunday. You know what I'm saying? I don't feel like I'm properly. They was probably talking all kind of shit about me when I left that motherfucker. And to this day, I don't give a fuck. 
I don't care. <laughs> I'm from the depths of my balls. I don't care. And I'm talking about these balls. I don't care, y'all. Like, But that's the type of confidence I have with whoever I'm around. I have not always been like this, but you got to get like it at some point. You got to know you her or you him. And I'm her. And he got to be him. You know what I'm saying? Period. I shouldn't swear to God, but... I never realized that until like today. And that we did that song you four years it? ago. Yeah. You know what I mean? Legend, me and Legend being the thumbnail. That's crazy. Like I didn't, I didn't notice those things. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, it's crazy. Yeah, it's crazy. Right, well, I really didn't. It's crazy. That's mad funny though. <laughs> no, nah, it was crazy. It was crazy. That was really your debut hit, like secretly. Oh, mad funny. That was really your supposed to be. Your but debut. that was your song. Yeah, it was crazy. You see, like, when you look at it, it's crazy. It's been a while. It takes years later to look back on shit. Yeah, the structure was off, and not one, not one person came forward and like disagreed. Yeah, said the structure was off. Now that's why you gotta watch nigga. <laughs> Fact. No, for real, because niggas, the same way you're like, yo, this is my moment, other people was looking at all like, this is my moment. Nah, yeah. that's really what was That's what it was. Everybody was trying to get their moment. Everybody's trying to get their moment. Yeah. And everybody's fighting for their moment and, and got their own reason behind why they think it's their moment or their new moment. And it's like, nobody's actually trying to make it my moment. Man. Yeah, no. That's what the crazy part You of wasn't trying to make it your moment. He literally just told Clarence that it was his moment. Clarence don't rap. He didn't even want to do it. This ain't his moment. This is you. Nigga, if I could, if, if, if Mod would fuck with me and not care so much about, or not no, only care so much, not get so offended by the things that I say, I will remind him all the time, you that nigga, the fuck are we doing here? <laughs> Come on now. No, 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 no. That's not a, 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 that was a Clarence moment. This is your song. <sighs> but I, I, go, I would be exhausted, like, like real shit, because some people just don't get how dope they really are. You know what I'm saying? They don't accept that. So they be trying to be somebody. I don't get it. All of it is I don't I've get never it. looked at it as my moment either. <laughs> you got what I'm saying? <laughs> I'm almost looking at it like. I'm like my mans. Yeah, like I'm I like all right, I'll do it. More like, people gonna look at yeah, 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 I'm gonna look at my mans because yeah. Really, yeah, that's how I always looked at it though though, bro. That's why like bro, I never had I never had no animosity about like when you like even when you speak on your side of Ote, like you absolutely right. Like I agree you had to compromise and yeah, I just never had no animosity towards you. But that's not how the video was taken. Well, I'm not gonna lie to one, you. One of the people that actually knew how I felt though. Yeah. You knew I didn't want to do like I didn't really want to do that shit. Yeah, it was really just the torture. You knew it. Yeah, it was it, that that created it. Yeah. And it was like the the reaction I was getting when I came out. It was like, yo, niggas gotta do something with this. Mm -hmm. Like this, <laughs> we need to do something with this. And it was like. But it's not, again, it's not what I wanted to do with it. You know what I mean? Nah, facts. Facts, facts. What facts. we should have did was I should have had, I should have came out with 30 t-shirts and, and threw them bitches in the crowd or something and then sell them at the end or some shit. Like, facts. Nah. That's what I want to do. Like, and people misunderstood. We never really shape-shifted to like who we were personally. Yeah, but. like we just kept things music. Mm -hmm. And not everybody do music and I, mm -hmm. I know you and Queen do, but... I don't do music, and I feel like that's where I always felt. But he, yeah, bro, I'm not gonna lie. Like this, the, I, I need everybody to understand this. Like, I feel like from from like a, a corporate perspective, with dealing with the three of us, like Queen has definitely been a, like an ultimate blessing, but it has also made like. It set like a trajectory of for like how we all should be handled when we're all very different. Yeah. So that's like what kind of like just I feel like threw off because it's like even though me and Queen both do music per se and it's like I'm trying to get to where she's at. It's like the way my shit is structured and how I operate is completely different in terms of just like mm -hmm. 
how often I drop music and stuff like that. So it's like we need to be handled with different yeah. care. Just like yeah. you would have your own thing yeah. going on. So it's just like, yeah. That was just always the the like blessing and, and I guess the thing that also threw off like how specifically me and you were handled in the situation. Yeah. And on that note, I'm gonna give a no comment. Look, yeah, um, what, uh, so what made you make it your second Twitch? Second Twitch, what do you mean? Make your Twitch where the where niggas is calling me. <laughs> mm. You was just fed up that day? No, that was well, responding to his about, video. The second twitch, the first twitch when you were talking about your pop. Yeah, you I just, yeah, I met you briefly in that Yeah, first yeah, yeah, you the just met you on, what did I say? Do you remember? I remember. <laughs> oh, I think, yeah, I went more into yeah, it. You yeah, went I way more in detail on the second twitch. Um, I felt like the first time I mentioned it, that first time, I thought, which I thought wrong, I thought me addressing it will leave it alone. But it made it And bigger. it didn't. Made it yeah, bigger. it made it bigger. I made it bigger. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It made it bigger. So me being in like my feelings and shit, just it kind of made it bigger. So now I'm like, now it's like more questions than what it originally was. It was just like, yo, where's my? Mm -hmm. <laughs> now it's like, nah. With like my mom answering yeah. certain niggas' phone yeah. calls and not answering your phone calls. What did you do to mine? Yeah, so that was like specific shit. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So now. Like and now everybody else is doing their vids, the, the the plug channels, all these channels doing their vids, and now it's coming, like people coming up with their own assumptions. I'm seeing TikToks and like it's just, I, I just couldn't believe. I think I let that was kind of the first time, not the first time, because I think it happened to me one other time, but from my perspective, I'm like, yeah, definitely man. like the comments and people's reactions definitely got to me. Mm. And I definitely reacted to that. Mm. Yeah, for sure. Mm -hmm. Yeah, for sure. That's very fair to say. Yeah. That's a very honest answer. People, the people do that though. The people do that. Mm -hmm. But your second Twitch, bro, I was in the crib. That's when niggas was like, bro, this, <laughs> this could be a moment. <laughs> yep. That's when niggas was like, you know, that, that Twitch niggas was telling me. To call you in the on middle. Twitch though, I'm like, nah, y'all niggas trying yeah, to go yo, viral. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Those, those, those are the niggas you yeah, can't really yeah, trust. Yeah, watch me in that picture <laughs> like that. You can say call him right now. I'm like, bro, this nigga is heated right now. I'm not calling this nigga in the middle of this. I'm like, bro, I'm in bed chilling. Niggas is like, call him. I'm like, call him right mm. now. It's crazy. Like, nah, I don't even want niggas to think that I'm just watching. I think I did do that though. It was because of the otation. I reacted to the otation. Yeah, and yeah, I yeah that my, was just after Yeah, that. I gave my own piece at the... But I did. I'm not going to lie, bro. It was just like like the $20 shit that killed me. It was like... It was just videos that I felt like... It's not what you said is what you didn't say. Mm -hmm. So you saying you're not talking about me... Is making niggas feel like they, you're talking about me. Nah, I get it. Do you get what I'm saying? Bro, you know, you, bro, you know, niggas had to sit me down and explain that to me because I didn't get it. I'm like, bro, I remember I'm sitting there. I'm like, yo, I can't do nothing without like my whole like existence revolving around me Man. and you. So I'm like, yo, this is crazy. Like I can't just have a conversation and niggas is like, niggas is like, bro, you can't do that. And I'm like, what you mean you can't do that? They like. Bro, y'all whole shit was y'all together. Now you talking, but you not talking about him, but you leaving him out. And it's like, bro, this fan base knows you two to be together. So if you're leaving him out, yeah. it immediately goes on him the well, same right way you feel like it goes on you. Mm -hmm. And I'm like, that was the first day I was like, oh shit like i'm over here thinking that i'm just getting all the beating when he's going on live but it's like yo what i'm not saying is also affecting you in yeah. the same way that was the first time when i realized it and it was fucking bj and Justin. i'm like yo well at least he listened to them niggas i got it like yo y'all got it I, I didn't even see it that way for real yeah i because i ain't mean no harm by what i say it's just like you again the old i watch it you didn't say anything wrong it's like what you're not saying it's like it's like if people try to read between the lines. All right, y'all, this is the first thing.
-hmm. That's what they're reading. Like between the lines is like, nah, Clarence did <laughs> like this. Like you know what I mean? Like yeah. you could like it's possible to say a lot without saying nothing. Like yeah, you know what I mean. So that that's that's what I was saying then. You know what I mean? It's trying to rain. And no matter what, even if you want to do your own thing, and like and I get it, bro. It's like. Your, your career and like what you say, like you always have to watch out and all of that because like, because it's like you're friends with us and like we have a huge platform and people take us too serious sometimes and like they'll just be overprotective and shit. I get that. That's why I didn't say like, that's why I try to make it clear that like you didn't say nothing wrong. Like he didn't say nothing wrong. It's just, yeah, it's just like I have to completely avoid the subject to even win anyway. That was the only way to completely avoid the subject. But, yeah, you got any more questions? I'm pretty sure I, I can think of some shit. <laughs> Give me like two minutes. <laughs> nah, nah, nah. All I can, nah, bro, but all I can really say. I think say, there's more shit, though. It's really more shit, but all I can really say is that most of this shit that, like, like, it started off between me and you as a problem, probably like this small. And it's just like people and stories. I was going to say that. That was my question. Yeah. Not question, but that was my statement. Another thing I felt, I feel like, is niggas don't want us to be friends. <laughs> and that's just crazy. That's how I feel. I'm not going to lie, bro. And it's like, it's mind boggling to me because mm -hmm. like people that... The fact that people don't want us to be friends is fake crazy. It's I like, agree. It feels like that sometimes. Yeah, it do feel like that. It almost feels like... You know, for a minute, I felt like I had to keep our friendship private. Like, you know what I mean? Like, yo, bro, yeah, we're speaking again, but like... I know I do, like... I have spoke to certain people, like, nah, mod is crazy. <laughs> like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, mod is fucking bugging. Yeah, like, yeah. So now for me to go back and like tell people different or 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 yeah it's like it's tough it's tough nah, you know what i mean nah, like, i feel you bro i feel you i feel, bro, i'm gonna go every day right now nah, yeah, I've, been, been, I've experienced yeah. some shit with you was crazy. <laughs> yeah bro, we've been friends for three weeks now back like talking yeah, all the time upset with you bro it'd be crazy bro it'd be crazy It'd be still times where I'm like, yeah, I'm gonna just leave that out our next combo. Like, I, yeah, you don't gotta yeah, share everything. Yeah, like, I don't gotta let niggas know I smoked yeah. clarence today. Like, yeah, hey, what you did today? <laughs> Chill. <laughs> Chill. I didn't tell my mom called me yeah. earlier and shit. You know? Tell it. You know? Because once you say, nah, I was with that nigga Mod. Yo, it's like, yo, yo you're crazy, crazy, bro. Like, bro, I'm not gonna lie. That nigga said he'll do a song with Chris Sale. <laughs> that, that's the other <laughs> Yo, stop! No, bro. those are the type of shit I'm gonna do. Yo. Oh, no. That gave Chris a reason to say something. Bro, niggas be. Oh, All right, well, I'm gonna no. stay out of it. I'm gonna stay out of it. Yo. But that's what niggas. Yo, nah, I feel you. Niggas though. was on your head. I, I, you know, I, was, I didn't feel no type of way about that. Bro, <laughs> yo, bro, niggas was on. Niggas was like, yo, bro, bro, niggas, bro, I had to make. Bro, I made like three videos trying to put that to bed. <laughs> Bro, <laughs> try to find the right thing to say. Yeah. I'm, like, yeah. I'm like, damn, it didn't work the first time. Yeah. Let me try it again. To me, it's like I'm being realistic, bro. Like, if you do actually do a song with him, that's your own. Like, you no, have to crazy. deal with that. No, that's you crazy. know what I mean? But no, like, that's it crazy, is, but no, like, it is crazy. Yeah. But you will have to deal with that, and I think you you are smart enough to know. Yeah. What will like? I would probably, need, like, I don't think you would do that. I would need the six nine Kodak bag. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You would have to give me yeah, some shit. Yeah, yeah I mean the six nine. I have to tell totally, That'd be worth it. I feel like I'm broke. Come on. Yeah, it has to be worth it. Bro, I can't turn that down. <laughs> I got bars for this thing. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Fast. Like, bro, like what? Like that? Like, there's no like, bro. That's why when it was just like, yo, people are taking us serious. Yeah, 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 but I think it's because. If we was cool, you would have never said that. Do you get what I'm trying to say? That's where it's like, if we were talking, you would, I get it. or you would have never put it that way. Like, you're like, nah, I do a song with the nigga. I don't really, like, there's no beef. But like, and I, I know what you was trying to do. I think you was trying to like, take yourself out of 
everything that involved me and like yeah. you know what I'm saying like me I like you organically don't have beef with Chris yeah. like you know what I'm saying yeah but like, you I, my man if he says something yeah, like, I'm, I'm gonna every yeah, time yeah. so it's like it's way yeah, yeah 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 it's way different so yeah but yeah that one was crazy that was when I was like yo I gotta chill I got, I got nah, niggas on your head for that. Yo, bro. niggas. And that was like a little part of the video. That was crazy. Bro, like a one second part. And I was like, is, is the song good? Like, I didn't That's like when you video. explain yourself to somebody and niggas only catch what they want to catch. Like, yeah, you, yeah, yeah like, bro. bro. It was like a whole video. And it's like, bro, the comment section is blowing up. Like, yo, this is crazy. Our personal friends are hitting me up, yeah. calling me crazy. That that was a day we don't even need to go oh, into that. Man, that was a day where the beef went up a whole nother level. Cause I'm like, yo, <sighs> niggas is niggas is wow, niggas is super. Yeah, I think everybody kind of acted out of emotion and like had probably had their own reasons on why. They, mm. That's what I'm saying. That niggas don't want us to be friends. <laughs> That's exactly what it is. That's where it comes back down to. And again, remember what we talked about earlier, though. It's not that people don't want us to be friends. It's people like it better when we're not friends. Yeah, I'm so it's it, not yeah, that yeah. people like, nah, I don't. They get to it. operate. It's just they different. like it better. It's they must be talking about the people around them got to be. And that ain't good either. It's it, another thing. Don't put your friends together. That shit is bad. I'm telling you. Well, well, depending on the situation. For some people, like it seemed like Mod's friends has an issue with Clarence. I, am I the only one getting that? <laughs> Let me know. Maybe I'm tripping, but that's what I'm hearing. It's like they have more access to you or more access to me. Like you say, you got more time. Or vice you versa. More, like, you know what I mean? Nah, facts. And it's like, I feel like a lot of people... I feel like what I learned from us not speaking to is that um, a lot of people don't fuck with me. People have their own problem with you. Yeah. yeah. But they gotta tell yeah. you if but, you're cool with and me. And yeah, they're not gonna tell me if yeah. we're cool. And then, and then like me being like on the out kind of made me like, oh, we're we're getting game. Mm -hmm. We almost have a thing. We we you finally figured it out. Like the why we feel away, and it's like, nah, bro, like. I don't think our relationships compare at all, but it was just, yeah, that that's what I really learned from more, more yeah. on the outside. Like, oh, a lot <laughs> of niggas feel have they hey, own crazy. feelings that they wouldn't never mm -hmm. tell me normally, but yeah. And niggas is, niggas is totally in the right for, you know, feeling the way they feel, mm -hmm. you know what I mean? I just thought the part I don't like is why don't you tell me, bro? Like I said, the kind of person I am, bro, I'm going to tell you. Like, yo, bro, why did you block me? <laughs> why did you unfollow me? Like, what's mm -hmm. up? Like, <clears throat> don't just, because then you know what, you know what bothers me? When I see niggas, it's happy. It's like, oh shit, hugs. Like, you know what I mean? Why That's the that part I don't like. But shit. then when you on the phone with them, it's like, nah, <laughs> this nigga's crazy. So do you see why I, I choose to be the way I am? Cause like, I don't know what's real, but I gotta do a better job of Finding out what's real, you mm -hmm. know what I mean? Yeah, because it's just like I think the real thing is just like we both we both like in terms of like most of our childhood or like relationships with people, we both get kind of put into the same bubble. In a way, of course, people know that you've experienced a higher level of like what they would call success than me, but um, they feel like I didn't change. So why do you change? So it's also like partly like just because of how I am naturally as a person that yeah. just makes it be like, well, yeah. I hit mod and mod wrote me right back and or mod did yeah. this and it's like mod right in the hood with us right <laughs> yeah. 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 yeah be making it, so work it puts for us, me. yeah it puts us both in it puts us both it puts us we always get compared in a bubble and it's just like. They compare your realness against like what they perceive mine as, and that's where you end up on the. That's what I really think with people. Like they don't mean to. No, I know. But they I just, yeah, I just think they. But again, bro, you you got to. One thing I I realized too is like, I can only look at me as me, but niggas take me seriously. Mm -hmm. Niggas take me ultra seriously, and I don't know. Sometimes I don't understand why or. 
how come? You know what yeah. I mean? Because if another nigga does it, it's like, ah, fuck that nigga. Yeah. <laughs> I get what you're saying. You feel me? Like, it's like, move on or, or be cordial with the nigga. Me, it's like, niggas be heartbroken. Mm-hmm. And I'm not saying it to be like an asshole or nothing, but niggas be hurt. You know what I mean? And mm-hmm. I, hey, but some niggas, I get it. Mm-hmm. But some- I think niggas want his energy. They want his company and don't know homo shit. Um, and they want to be a part of that life. Uh, at, at one moment, I was like, well, damn. I'm going to just say this. You, you have to learn what business is and what pleasure is, especially with having YouTube friends. So I'm officially over the YouTube friend uh, era. You know what I'm saying? I've had my era. Anybody from YouTube who who is uh, cool, I'm going to keep them at a cool YouTuber. You know what I'm saying? Never a YouTube friend because niggas really don't know the difference. And that's that's bad. And it's all of us. All of us, it's a problem. So it ain't just them. You know what I'm saying? But it's just, it's bad. Some niggas I don't. It just be wild. Like, I don't. Yeah. I get exactly what you mean. Shit, bro. I don't know. Again, I don't deal with that shit. <laughs> you know, I don't deal with that shit. Niggas take me too serious. Yeah, you know? I don't deal with that shit. Because it's like, bro, because I, I play the game better than you at least, too. Like, I'm going to play it. I'm like, yeah, I don't know. I don't play the game way better than you. I'm not good at the game. Yeah, you're not playing. Yeah, you don't play the game. I'm not good at the you game. You don't play the game. But is there any more for a uh, wrap up of our discussion? I think that I just brought up that well, shit. You don't got nothing else? You don't got something you wanna maybe end with for you got some time though. You you could go a little longer if you want. I think you got like forty. Good forty minutes right now. Right now? Hell yeah. <laughs> part forty two, part minutes. Two, <laughs> Yo, part of forty minutes is like You're at forty one minutes right Look, now. Um, that's what I'm saying, we're good. You could be good. That's you what I'm saying. You could I'm trying to think. What else? Just end it good. Like if you have a statement, if you have something to say. You know, if you want to just be real or let them know some transparent, anything like, you know what I mean? Just make sure. Because, bro, I'm not going to lie, bro. That's one thing niggas loved about us. Mm-hmm. And niggas, but it's like me, you, and Queen, bro, niggas loved that we were just so real. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. that's in an in a, in a, in a industry where it's all fake. Everybody's fake and shit. Everybody like we kept it real. Like you know what I mean. We always kept it real. So I know the older you get, and like the more lit you can become, and the more it's harder to be real. Cause it's like now, nigga, y'all, y'all using my realness against me. It's like shit. But well, I can't even say that's cap. You right? Cause that realness shit. People, when you be real with people, they then they think you you. You being like a aggressive person or that's what I'm saying. I, I, I realized <laughs> I've gone through so much shit. I realized like when you when you select the people that you genuinely going to have a connection with, because friendships are literally like relationships. When you realize I'm going to have this connection with this person, you got to know everything about that person and people will give you them in five minutes. People give you all of them in five minutes. And if the people don't give you them, your intuition does. Okay. So my intuition with anybody I've befriended and not friends with today, I knew in the beginning that it wasn't going to go. I knew in the beginning this, this ain't going to work, but I'm going to try it anyway. So now I know What's not going to work? I'm not going to try it anyway. All right? We had fun for this moment. You know what I'm saying? Probably never see you again. You know? But be blessed. And it's not because they're such a bad person. You're such a bad person. That ain't it. Sometimes niggas just don't vibrationally click. And that's something that I had to learn it, it ain't always somebody got beef with you. You know what I'm saying? It ain't always, oh, I hate this motherfucker. It ain't always that. Sometimes you just don't vibrationally connect, and that's okay. You know what I'm saying? I learned that. I'm, that was one of the best lessons I've ever learned because we don't. Ha- I don't have to beef with you, baby. 
If I see you out, yep, you all right? Hell yeah. You know what I'm saying? And if I don't speak to you, I just really don't fuck with you. 444 in the chat. But, yeah, it's like a, you know what? You were better off with them. They are more of your kind of people to be around than me. So I completely get it now. You know what I'm saying? I'm an acquired taste. I tell people, thank you, Nikki, baby. I tell people all the time, I am an acquired taste. But it's some people I had to tell that to, and it's some people we never had to discuss it. It was never a discussion. Danny, long live Danny. It was never a discussion, ever. I learned so much after him passing. It was never a discussion, ever. Met each other, loved each other. Nigga, that was it for 13, 14 years. We may not have always seen each other all the time. He was busy, I was busy, we had shit to do. But you just know, you know what I'm saying? When you got to tell a person, I'm an acquired taste, they ain't for you. I'm telling you right now. Because you telling them that for a reason. It's some people, they, they naturally an acquired taste. But it's some people that's not an acquired taste. They don't even know they're an acquired taste either, if they are. It's just some people you just not going to get along with, gang. And uh, one of the best feelings in the world to know. <laughs> Real shit. Yeah, stay real, man. That shit'll get you Gotta through stay life. Real. Shit, I don't really know, bro. I feel like shit. My realness. I feel like my realness has like one one thing. I feel like that. I guess this is honesty point with YouTube. I feel like with YouTube specifically, it's definitely been a great journey for me. It changed my life in in, in a lot of ways. But I feel like like people have always confused it as like my Excuse thing me. that I want to do. And it's not like something that I, I'm against. And I know I got to be way better with being on the platform. But I feel like people have always confused it as like the only thing I do when it's like to me. In everybody else's head, it's my main thing because that's how they came into view of me. But to me, it's like it's my second, it's my second thing, or like my third thing mm -hmm. at times. And um, YouTube ain't his yeah, thing. Yeah, I just feel like that's some when honesty it comes for to your ass. Transparent. I've been every, like every time I was up, they knew. Every time I was down, they knew. I come and tell them directly that it's like. Yeah, there's certain parts that's like, I got a Caribbean family, you know, my mom don't want to be on no camera, my dad don't want to be on no camera, so you never really met my mom and dad formally, and, or like that part, or like, you know, they don't know what's going on in my family, but shit, I feel like I just always been transparent, and I feel like that's just the one part that sometimes I feel like I don't get no credit for, you know, just... Mm -hmm. As a YouTuber, because it's like if I'm fucking yeah, transparency, yeah, I don't feel like I get no credit. Like I need to be down and act yeah, like yeah, they hiding it. Like I'm never like I'm never like I never every time I was struggling or I had a hard yeah, I came on here and explained like yo, I was going through this, 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 and this, this, and this. Like niggas know I've been walking the Publix for six months. So you feel me? I walked to the supermarket and back. I lost my whip in the last. You feel me? Uh, year and all of that trying to figure out life. I just got on fucking probation literally this month before I went to fucking um, Mexico. So it's just like, yeah, I just feel like I don't get enough credit for my transparency. But other than that, like, I want to I think, I think, um, I think you are transparent, but just with yourself. Mm. And I think that's real. In order for someone to invest in you, like mm -hmm. time and shit. They want to know more. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Um. So like, like, let's use me for instance. My transparency could be my relationship, my girlfriend, mm -hmm. and my kids, which I do show, so they appreciate it. I'm not being all the way transparent with like me, sir. Mm -hmm. But like, you have to. I feel like you could just find a way to make it find be, that balance. Yeah, like a little more transparent, cause. You can be transparent and still be a mystery. I think that's what you're stuck in right now. Word. Nigga. <laughs> like, you think you saying something to me, but you ain't even said shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, 
I'm so transparent to say, <clears throat> if you two were my second thing, I would have said it. You know what I'm saying? Like, yo, listen, you ain't even got to hit me up for like IRL content is second for me. It's not something I'm going to do first. It's not something I even want to do first, to be honest with you. I want to get on here and talk my shit. I like my computer set up. I like coming to my computer. I like feeling like I got an office job. You know what I'm saying? Um, I like talking about what's going on in the world. This is my first thing. But if you get to hit me up like, yo, let's do some IRL content. All right, bet. I'm going to hit you up when I'm done with this content. You know what I'm saying? That's transparency. He decided to be like, ah, uh, I do want to get my music done first, but I'll, all right, I'll just come do it. No, 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 no. I'm going to get my music done first. And then when I, when it's time for me to fuck with YouTube mentally, I, I'll come fuck with it. But today it ain't that day. You know what I'm saying? He got to stand on his shit. Right now yeah. it's like you are a mystery. Niggas don't know about mod other than he's cool with Clarence. He's cool with Queen. Raps. He raps. He likes yeah, to rap. Going through shit. Yeah, he, and goes he be through going shit. through shit. Like, you know Facts. what I'm saying? That's like you. It don't get no deeper. Than when that. a woman you, came into play, dubbed her. We was like, "What the fuck is going on?" You know, no explanation. And you know, niggas feel like I ain't got to explain nothing to y'all. But sometimes you do to certain, you know, to certain fans. Not to me. I don't give a shit. But certain fans, like niggas, like I want to know because if you if you don't tell them. Then they get to making their own assumptions. And then niggas like, y'all just like, core, y'all just want to make y'all own assumptions. Nigga, you put us in the chat. Hell wrong with you. Are we not just making our own assumptions? You came out with what it was. So now we talking about it, but now it's not that. Nigga, then what is it? You know, that's transparent. Tell us what the fuck going on. Then you can, you might get the right opinion out of uh you know what i'm saying some people <laughs> like if they understand what the fuck going on y'all just be throwing out shit it don't you make no I mean? sense so like you got it like it's like I gotta find you gotta add house. another layer there where like word i agree with that 100 like, percent. Like, yeah people probably fuck with your transparency but people want to know like who you like who do you like what kind of girl do you like what kind of you know what, what what are you like when you when you are in love like you know what i mean like and i know that's not out of your control <laughs> You know what I mean? Like, love is someone's out of your control, but yeah. she, you can show them, you know, certain things. Like, you know what I mean? And another thing is just consistency. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, I've, consistency. I've, yeah. I've had problems with myself, you know yeah. what I'm saying? But I feel like now that we are cool and, like, you know what I'm saying, we could definitely motivate each other and do, like, again, right. I want you to win, gang. Like, I want to not, I, I want to win, really too, but I want to win in. Like, I want to win with you, though. Yeah, like, you know what I mean? Right. Like, me too. Let's go cop yours. Like, <laughs> Man, I'm not going to lie. I was ill. I was ill right let's there. Let's go cop yours. Bro, bro, shit, Man. bro. Like, you know what I mean? I just don't want you to. I know I know. a lot of people be complaining because I, I show, like, tough love. And I know mm -hmm. sometimes, like, I think in the moment, in the, in the moment, in the situation that you were in at the time when we stopped talking, I don't think you needed tough love. Yeah, I think that's where I messed up. It was kind of like it was times you gave me tough love and it worked though. A lot, most of the time. Yeah, tough love right works. Was, yeah, yeah, tough love. But I think work. in a you was in a delicate moment in your life. Yeah. With like beast pack. No, no more tough love coming from me. It seemed like when I get to showing tough love, I'm a devil. Oh my god, she didn't even care about that. Nigga, I care, but like, when are we gonna get out of this? I'm a move forward type of nigga. God damn, I just got shot, but oh, all right, we got to fix this and then let's move on to the next thing. Why am I going to, my, my leg is healed. My wound is closed. Why am I still talking? Why do we have to stay on this shit? I get it. It's going to happen, but damn, like, we got to stay there. Like, I don't want to stay there. I don't like to stay there. Let's move. Let's move forward, man. And everything just so, you know, what I'm saying that's something I, I didn't. I don't know if you knew, but my therapist had like pointed out to me like, you guys all lost somebody. You guys all have to have a a different level of patience with everybody. Just because you are handling it a certain way, don't mean he has to handle it the same way. Mm -hmm. Or and that is true. That's true as well. The same way. That's mm -hmm. something my therapist really put me on. Something to. people always say to me, or used to rather, is. 
I'm not like you. You are absolutely right. And I'm not here wishing that you were. But if you're going to ask me for my opinion, bitch, I'm going to give it to you. You know what I'm saying? But now I'd be like, ah, <laughs> not thundering on BTL day. Oh, hell no. Y'all, why is it thundering on BTL day? It's Beyonce Lana today. Ah, uh, pissed. And I ain't really realize, you know what I'm saying? Because the B shit hurt me too, gang. It really did. Nah, you know what I mean? That shit hurt me, but that shit changed everything. It literally changed everything. Yeah, it changed everything. everything. I don't think, to this day, it's I don't still think niggas know you. how important he was yeah, to the team. Nobody gets it. Nobody gets it. Niggas just look at him as security, but nah, it's like he's way more. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's Draymond Green. Yeah. He's really Draymond. Like, for instance, if Beast was here, we, we would have talked. Ne we would have never s not spoken for that long. And that's a fact. Yeah. He would have just. I know that for a fact. Yeah, like, I could, that, I could, yeah, I could yeah, yeah, we would have never made it this long. Yeah. So that was another thing that was weighing on me, too. Like, that's tough. Damn, man. Beast would have been the. Because he has He would have been the perfect bridge. He has the respect. You respect him. I respect him. He would have been the perfect bridge. Beast calls bridge. me and tells me. Go talk to mom. Yeah, we nigga, like, been, I, or I'm in the hotel. Yeah, 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 it would have been Yeah, yeah, it would have happened. Yeah, it would have happened. Yeah, I would have not ignored Beast to ignore you. Like that just wouldn't have happened. Yeah. Rest in peace, Beast. Yeah, Beast but, yeah. definitely, definitely would have changed. It wouldn't have been a year and three months now with Beast here. And I was gonna say something too when I was on the topic of you and YouTube. Oh, I also think, I know YouTube is like the third, second thing you do. No, nah, I wanted, I wanted to But I right. do think you're like fighting it though. Do you get what I'm saying? I think you've been fighting it for years. Like I know this is going to probably sound crazy me bringing it up. But even like you fighting Patty and things like that's you fighting who, like, it's, it's, like, the, the, it's not who people want you to be. It's like people... It's, you're fighting against who people love. Yes. You get what I'm saying, bro? You're a natural born entertainer. Mm hmm And I know your your gift and your 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 dream is music, but I feel like you fight against I've always fought against that part of myself. Though. Yeah, like, like you don't want like, to fake fuck with you. Yeah. You don't fake fuck with that side of yourself. I don't want to like, be too funny because it's like, bro, it's like being the little guy. I feel like that's the part of it that I have to get over. What being the little, little guy? guy? My whole life, it's like I don't. I know I'm funny, and I know I can be the funniest guy here or the guy you joke. But like now, you joke, and you're gonna play too much with me. Yeah. So to avoid you playing too much with me, let's just always put respect in things, and that does hinder me in certain ways. But it's just like. I, I ends up with me getting treated how I want to be treated. He's so complex. You, know you got to find that balance on like demanding your respect and also being entertaining. Mm -hmm. Definitely. Because you are complex, you are entertaining, man. bro. Like you, nigga. You talk about things like Twitch, nigga. You like. You're you're you you are you're made for shit like that. Like I'm not gonna lie, I'm not gonna say to put that on your back. Like, but you're made for a live stream kind of nigga. Like you're, you know what I'm saying? You could naturally be entertaining at all times. You can do me fighting shit. Yeah, bro. He gotta believe yeah, the worth, y'all. He gotta believe it. If he don't believe it, it ain't nothing. Clarence can say he gonna talk to he blue and they gonna fall out again. God forbid. But it's like, man. I've had this problem though uh, with with uh, someone from a long, long, long time ago. That was my dog, but I'm trying to tell you your worth. I'm ready to move up higher and buy, just get a nice place. You know what I'm saying? A nice car and niggas is just not going with me. And sometimes we gotta leave them. You know what I'm saying? Like, goddamn boy, I love you, but shit. I gotta go. You know what I'm saying? And um, Clarence love this nigga, boy. He, he love Bro, him. You're like, don't fight the bad. 
Like, yeah, don't fight, like don't the, fight the bag. It's the real though. Don't fight the bag. I think that's a great this way to This your job type shit. Don't fight, don't the, fight bag. the bag. Why that's are statement. you and that's losing money? I know I be showing tough love and I, I get what Clarence talking a, about. We had a talk where like I was saying like music is your dream. It's a dream. Like it doesn't have to happen. Mm -hmm. And that was a very serious talk we had because you like nigga, that's not no dream, nigga. I, like I'm gonna be a rapper. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm what like, are you I'm about? like, yo, bro, that's uh, bro. I'm not saying. I'm just saying like that doesn't have to happen. Do you get what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Like I know that would like it's. It, I know I compared it to like my clothes, like. Mm -hmm. Me dropping clothes and it being successful doesn't have to happen. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? But like, in the meantime, I'm just gonna still get the bag. Like, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? Got so to can say whatever. Like, well, got he's not to. Doing he not. Damn, he I hope clothes. this power he hasn't cut dropped the clothes line in five years. Mm -hmm. But I've been getting it. Like, yeah, 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 like you can't so say. You can't yeah, you yeah. can't say. So it like, keeps the conversation good. Yeah, so keeps just the conversation in the right spot. Don't fight the bad game. Don't fight the bag. Don't fight the bag, bro. You been fighting the bag? I just be wanting shit. I just be wanting to control life. And you know, I tell people that all the time. Like, yeah, you can't control life. But a nigga like me, I be trying to control life and make it go how I want it to go. A lot. Never happen. Yeah. And that's been my. But I think problem. niggas. I think you just gotta. You you one of the niggas. You remind me of Queen a little bit when you, like yeah, I kind of gotta go through it to learn. Mm -hmm. Like that's the only like, way I learn. Me just telling y'all. Is not gonna work. It doesn't work for them. I don't learn shit from just yeah, hearing. Yeah, it's like y'all have to go through it and fail. That and sucks. Like, yeah, I yeah. should have fought the back. So, yeah. so <laughs> I was told this like, Nick, you just gotta let me fuck it up. Why? I'm sitting here telling you, I went through that. I did fuck it up. It was fucked up. I already went through that. Why? Why the fuck? As a friend, would I want to sit here and say, all right, go through it, fuck it up. Like, I don't believe in being that friend. So, unfortunately, I can't be that friend. I, I can't. I, I can't do it. Hey, hey, can you watch me follow my face real fast? No, nigga. I'll be at the crib. Just let me know when you're done. Yeah, like, mm -hmm. and I think, because Queen deal, dealing with this, too, I think you guys look at YouTube as something hindering being rather honest. than benefiting. People laugh at me when I, I swear on every day, I'll be 64 doing YouTube. Well, oh God. <laughs> I don't care Talk if I'm a billionaire it. or whatever. Oh like, God. I just enjoy, says that, yeah, I I swear enjoy to God. YouTube, bro. And it's like, you <laughs> created a source of shit. income for yourself. Why neglect it? Yeah. Why neglect it? My mom be telling me that sometimes too. It don't make sense. Like, man. So you're not uploading no videos. And it's not like you're not good at it, bro. You've made money off of there where a lot of people dream of. So if you know you could do it, that means you could do it again, right? Yeah. That's what make me not quit, y'all. Nigga, I got shit to do. And I got bills and kids and shit. That's what be getting me tight about myself. There's oh my niggas God. out there right now with a hundred subscribers uploading for every it. day. Praying for it. And I have three million subs and I'm playing with it. Hello. Like that's, come on. That's why niggas got to stop smoking. Because it's like, what are we doing here? Like, I'm taking my ble my own blessings for granted. Yeah, you know? like, correct. We and it does, it's, nothing, has, it's, nothing has to be Ooh. promised. Ooh. My son wants to go take a piss real quick. Y'all know I would have been, Pete. But yeah, man. I'm not going to lie. This is... <laughs> this nigga Clarence gotta get close and shit. I know this is part two of my shit, you know what I'm saying? But real nigga to real nigga. I'm a little, you know what I'm saying? But I miss my nigga. And that's real shit. Everything that I came out and said and did, it was just out of, out of hurt and shit, you know? And there was a moment where I thought we would never be friends again. You feel me? And I'm glad we could get past that shit and really move on from it, you know what I'm saying? Facts. At the end of the day, I just want my nigga to win. You know what I'm saying? Facts. And I think, I think this little situation that we've been through kind of opened my eyes on like the power I do have and where I can help and where I can't. You know what I'm saying? And Facts. I can probably help in more areas than I originally thought. So, yeah. You know, I apologize to y'all and shit, but yeah, man, we gotta move on from here. <laughs> well, I gave you a little, I gave you a good minute. <laughs>
extra minute or you could just add it in there. Yo, bro. They gonna fuck with this. <laughs> Yo. Yo, you got 55 minutes. Bro, I could have filled up a bathtub just now. I'm not gonna lie. That was crazy. That was crazy, bro. That was crazy. But, um... <laughs> Filling yeah, up bro, a bathtub is crazy. You got like 55 minutes. Yeah. We sat here and talked for two hours. Nah, facts. But going forward, definitely got to stop fighting the bag. Word. You don't fight the bag. Nah, I don't fight the bag. You go where the bag is. But, 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 but <laughs> one thing I do admire about you is, though, you're willing to live and die about your dream. And that's something I need to, because... I love all of this and, and and I appreciate it and everything, but I will never truly be happy unless I put out my yeah, clothes. Yeah, bro, and that's how, that, that's so why I like this stuff. No, but yeah, bro, but you can still be happy in the me. Like, you know what I mean? You don't like, gotta be, yeah, yeah I don't, you gotta, don't be, gotta be fucking, not everybody's story is fucking, you know? Yeah. Yeah. Got it out the mud. It don't have to be so big rap against. Yeah, it doesn't like. It doesn't have to be so big. Yeah, so especially when niggas already figured it. Like yeah, you know what I mean. Like, like niggas already found something they good at. They Clarence good. talking that shit. Dude, yeah, but grow. you know I'm not gonna lie. I'm really tired of making mixtapes and like rapping about like struggling. That is, I think that's the thing too. I think like bro, so that's one thing. Too. I'm not gonna lie. Damn, this is going. This is getting out of hand. <laughs> but, um, before we start talking, bro, one of the things that I did notice, and I should have probably took a little more heed to, is that, bro, you were just really, like, sad. And, like, everything so, like, so so you'll call me and be like, what's up, bro? Yeah. Like, like no, like, I'm asking you, you're you doing videos? Hey, nah, bro, I got, like, I'm just, like, it's just everything, yeah. so, you know what I'm saying, bro? And it's not usually like that, bro. Yeah. You call me, and I could probably change your mood. Yeah. You call, I call you, you could probably change my mood. So, yeah. I, that's how I knew. Remember, I think we said it was like a midlife or like a beginning life crisis. I was shit. watching too much Grey's Anatomy and shit. Yeah, I was watching bro, Mad you was Grace. stuck in the crib. You didn't want to do nothing. You didn't want to go nowhere. Like, yeah. we went to Disney. You didn't want to go to Disney. Yeah. We went to, like, bro, you didn't want to go. You didn't want to do nothing. You didn't want to go nowhere. You didn't want to, like, you know what I'm saying? And it was just like, that's how I felt. And then, then I go on Twitter and it's like, Maybe he was depressed. Very like cryptic. Yeah, like the niggas was, ain't fucking with me yeah. now. Don't fuck with me later. <laughs> like yo, bro. Like bro, I think niggas missed the positive vibe. Like you know what I mean? Like the optimistic vibe. Like, yeah. yeah, like bro, you yeah. you have the ability to change niggas' energy. Don't be the don't be that energy. You yeah, know? I was quitting. I gave up. Right yeah, there. I can tell a little bit. Like you was just yeah. feeling down on yourself. And I probably should have like you know. But ask more. Ain't nothing he could do in that moment. I'm not gonna lie. More questions or probably try to. Well, I don't know. I've talked some people out some shit. Uh, shout out to Binks. One time I was sad. I was like, you know what? Because shit kept happening. I said, I'm just about to fucking sleep all day. I'm not even gonna lie. I don't wanna feel it. So I'm just gonna sleep. And she said, no, the fuck you not. <laughs> I will never forget Binky said that shit. She said, no, the fuck you not. <laughs> what you're about to do, okay? At that time I was driving, I was doing Uber. She was like, nigga, you better drive all day than sleep all day. That's not what this is about. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I love that. Because normally I'm the one to tell niggas, no, the fuck you not. What the fuck are you talking about right now? Nigga, she said... Excuse me? <laughs> I love that. I love that. I got my ass up. I love that. What, the, what are you doing? Hell no. Nah. Get my ass up. Get my shit together. <laughs> Fix it, but it's like everything I did was just like. I, I just don't think that was. That was that hilarious. That was out of my power. Yeah, yeah I just had to go through that. Yeah. I have to go through that. It was a lot. It just and it was it was really a like girl. Bro. Yeah, he was going through girl shit too. Yeah, it was like, oh. I can't relate. He was heartbroken. <laughs> Sorry, I know oh, that came shit. out wrong. I, but nah, I just can't relate. Like, I just couldn't been, relate to it. I'm, I'm like, bro, if you don't just leave, <laughs> leave this joint alone. <laughs> I just can't. I'm like, bro, it's not that easy. Yeah, yeah, yeah it's not that me easy. It was just so simple, but it's like I know, I already know, bro. But yeah, like bro, I, I never went through that. I would never made love, love. Needed love, love right there. Love, love was a bright spot in a dark time. <laughs> needed, yeah, yeah. needed love, love. I know, I'm pretty sure I gave you a lot of like 
faith, yeah, right? Yeah, like, that like, changed my, that changed me. That was, bro, that brought me back. Like, I'm not bugging. Bro, Love Love brought me back. Like, I needed Love Love. Like, Love Love damn near saved me right there. Like, I'm going through probation and shit, but I'm like, yo, I got a song. It's doing good. Like, this is all I was looking for. Like, mm -hmm. this is the light at the end of the tunnel. That shit saved me. That's when I started doing TikToks every day and got consistent with something. I'm like, yo, I got to find a way to be consistent with something. It's not mm -hmm. going to be YouTube right now, but I got to be consistent with something. That ass, love, love, save me, bro. That ass, save me. Save me. Well, this is a good thing. Well, then you gotta be, a, you are, you be transparent with certain things, but you just be transparent with things like that too, like that, bro. I just. Yeah, but you know what it is, bro. I talk to when I talk to women a lot, and we don't gotta go too deep wow. into this. But when I talk to women, I don't always talk to the woman that's okay with like me speaking about it socially like you know mm. what i'm saying like most of my joints don't they don't do the camera stuff so like for me to even go online and speak about them even if i'm being transparent with them and feel like i'm being a little weird so it'd be yeah, like that's a part like that's a part of my life that people always been like yo why you don't tell us about the girls and shit but yeah. it feel like i fake have to just be pee like i'm not about to be able nah, to nah but nah you could keep it pee but at the same time niggas need to know that this is what you do like this is your living so it come with it like you know what i'm saying like nah, facts. like that's what that's what it is like niggas just gotta accept it you want to with me you might end up on a youtube video or you know your man your name might come up or something but yeah, that's sort of what it was. I just felt, I knew it was in like a negative place. There's a lot of negative energy coming from you. And instead of like trying to like fix it, I think I kind of stepped back. Cause it was like, we just was even talking less before we even stopped talking. Like we, we were just talking like talking less. as a group. Like we wasn't yeah, talking more like yeah, how we yeah, normally yeah, spoke yeah. where it was me and you. We was just yeah. talking more like, oh, group game, getting high. That's, mm -hmm. really, that's really all it was doing. Like, you game, getting high. I'm complaining most of it. And I feel like my conversation at that point in time, too, had to be, like, annoying to deal with, too, because I'm always talking about it. It was. Joint. It like, was. Yo, it was. It was. Yeah, like, yo, this joint. I'm dealing with this with this joint. Like, yo, it wasn't yeah, this. Yeah. It was, no, it was funny. It was like, sometimes, bro, we'd be like, yo, ma, get online. Nah, bro. <laughs> this. <laughs> Nah, gang, like, <laughs> so, okay, nigga, so, like some other shit, like, bro. This nigga was so, heartbroken. Like, I need to figure this out. I need to do it, like, and I, I felt that at the same time, but, you know. Um, yeah, bro, I feel like everybody was like, happy, happy too. I'm going through that shit. Like, everybody else is like, bro, get on the fucking <laughs> game, bro. Like, yeah, we're, like, we're just trying to have fun, yeah, but like, genuinely. Like, yeah, and, and, and for Adam and Pete, too, niggas is just genuinely trying to have fun with their mans. But it means it's just like I'm not, you're not in a space I'm to not have fun. Space. You're not in space. That's it. And it's like you know what it is too. I realize that um, that by experiencing some of the highs that I experienced in life, my lows is way worse than niggas' lows because yeah, it's like, yeah. like when you I'm going more yeah when when I, like, yeah when I'm going through my lows, it's like. Why is yes. it working? Why can't I figure it out? Why we're like another nigga be like, oh this I just gotta go through this. So like this is what life is right yeah. now. Ooh, I've been here before, saying, nigga. Me, yeah, me. They yeah. be looking at me like I got eight heads. Like nigga, yeah. you, you good, bro? Like, no, bro. But I'm bro. not doing what I want to do, bro. Like, like, bro, that's a nut, bro. That's that, bro. And that's another thing, bro. You can't like niggas be having no bro, sympathy. I got, bro, I got, bro, I got nobody to feel sympathy from. Like, and I'm not saying that I'm that I'm looking to feel sympathy, but like nah, niggas, niggas can't it, relate. Nah. Niggas, niggas that can't relate, not give niggas me no can't sympathy. relate, bro. But bro, I realize that I can't relate though, cause I'll be talking to a nigga, I'll be talking to a nigga, and I'll be like, yo, bro, like yo, all I need is twenty bands a month, and I'm good. Like that's where I need to be. If I could do twenty bands a month, and another nigga be on the phone with me like, bro, you could do twenty bands in a month, and I'll be like. And I'll be sitting there like, oh shit, that's a possibility for me if I get right. But like another nigga don't even have that as an yeah, option yeah, yeah. for for us. Those niggas still looking at me like I'm crazy. But I'm like, shit, the numbers I'm hearing other niggas doing, I'm going light. Like you know what I'm saying? Word. But it's just like circle. You already like you, you, yeah. You did already. Like you already know. Yeah, what I'm worth and capable of. So yeah, if you don't reach certain heights too, you can't even see it the same way. So yeah. So when I be going through lows, mo. Yeah, niggas' lows be lows. My lows be low. My lows be low. They hit a little different. Yeah, they My lows be low. But 
Shit. Well, that show that was you got an extended part two. Nah, nah I got it too. No, nah, but your part, your part one got like more, more like well, I should just, I should this turned to like a podcast deep nah, discussion. Did, did. The first part is like the story part, but um, yeah, y'all. Uh, I think you had like an hour. Yeah. Yeah, oh. like an hour. Hour and three minutes, yo. Yeah. <laughs> you edit shit. You know, I probably have to edit certain parts, like cut, but not nothing crazy on this. I'm about to say it's a long ass video. I probably right? cut this into two parts for real, but um, still cut it into two parts. But um, yeah, and a lot of them, the long videos do be busting though. Facts. Hour is a thing because you throwing especially on the edge. <laughs> Word, <laughs> better talk You're about it, nigga, because that's what I'm about to do. You only really need one. For I'm trying to take these, yeah. These doing, yeah, they do. Hour long joints, dub. But um, but yeah, yeah. though. Huh? It's the end of the vid. It's your boy MOD in the spot. Like, comment, share, subscribe. If you ain't never heard Love Love, go bump it. And um Yeah. You got anything else to say, bro? Yeah, man. Just I'm back. <laughs> I'm back, gang. You know what I'm saying? Don't be so surprised you see me. You know what I'm saying? Stop all in stop. the videos. <laughs> Yo, stop commenting on niggas live asking yeah, if they mean. Like we here, like good. It is. Go tune in on the Twitch. Niggas is getting on Twitch, back on Twitch. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So make sure y'all yeah. tune in. Yeah. I heard that we had the Twitch shit too. <laughs> Nigga, y'all had a lot, but listen, um, if my decide this time, you know what? I'm gonna get out my feels. I'm gonna get this bag. I'ma listen to my bro a little bit and 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 just step out on a little bit of faith. And he'd be up in 30 days. Fuck are we talking? You talking about 20 my. You know what I'm saying? Like you you could be making like 50. You know what I'm saying? But anyway, all right, y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below. We done with this video. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Hell yeah.